We do have some positive news to share tonight about cases in the COVID-19 pandemic. New virus cases now declining all across the United States. And experts say it's due in part to more and more people wearing masks and social distancing. Johns Hopkins University says about 40,000 cases, 43,000 cases are being reported every day. And that's down about 20% since the beginning of August. So that's a pretty good drop. There are also concerns about the virus picking up across the Midwest. For example, here in the state of Indiana, the average of new cases every day has been about 864. We've seen that number here for the last week. And also we want to know why are you wearing a mask and why do you mask up? You can share your pictures and your stories with us. You can do so on our free WTHR news app and perhaps we'll share some of those images during our newscast on 13 News later this week. Indianapolis now has a plan to help people who are out of work. The city is launching a rapid re-employment response plan. This is an online resource to help connect the unemployed with career services, training, and also support. They're also using more than $1 million from the CARES Act to make it all happen. If you're interested, you can check out the details on our website. We have it all posted for you at WTHR.com. Also now, we have just learned that the Department of Public Works plans to completely reopen Broad Ripple Avenue and Mass Ave right after Labor Day. If you've been downtown right now, you know those streets have some barriers and those are put in place for people to eat outside. Keep in mind, however, as we move forward, there are select businesses that have permits to expand seating into the parking that's right outside their doors and those businesses can keep the barriers up for now.